Number two in to kick this one off. off to start the game. Number 86 back to return. Booming kick downfield. From the one yard line. This play will be the first of the game for the offense. Eight defenders in the box on this one. He'll pass on first down. Gets the pass off, and he fails to hang on to that one. There's not one wide receiver who can ever claim that he's never dropped a pass. It's just part of the game. Second and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. It's showtime, baby. The Eagles come out in the 46. Throws it. Right on target to the wide receiver. A great one-on-one -on -one stop by number 32. Might be a face mask call, but will it be five Person or 15 foul. yards? Face mask on the defense. From the 32, automatic He got first hold down. of his face mask on that one. Now, there's two types of face masks. There's a five-yard variety and a 15-yard variety. They said he grabbed it and twisted it, and it's going to be an automatic first down. They're shifting the linebackers. Only one man back for the counter play. This one will be spotted at the 33. Langford busted through for a few tough yards. Ball on the 33-yard line. The defense changing its coverage. Keep moving. Looks like they'll play bump and run on the outside. On the carry. Robinson is there on the stop at the 30-yard line. Mixon runs with passes, keeps the defense on. Gain of three. On third down, they have to get it to the 29-yard line for a first down. The corners are moving up to press the receivers. Hand it off. The 20, the back breaking free. Five, touchdown. What a run by the veteran. Yeah, because of his experience and knowledge of the game, he can still take it to a defense, even though the initial burst of quickness may not be there. Number five. Comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. Great job moving the ball down the field for a touchdown on their first possession. I really like the way these guys came right out after Jan Offen. They made the right calls, the executed properly, and put that one right in the end zone. Good distance. From the two-yard line. It's still very early. But this is one of those spots where you'd like to be able to respond and put the ball in the end zone. On a day like today, John, with rain expected throughout the day, do you think one team has the advantage over the other? No, I really don't. The field is already muddy. It's just going to get sloppier as the game wears on. It's going to be tough for both of these offenses to hold on to the ball. Running the ball consistently is a first step in creating a balanced attack. And he picks up about four. Number 31, the lone back. Hand it off. Gaines is there for the tackle at the 24. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. Gain of three. Third down and three coming up. The defense is going to play this one very tight. Minnesota lines up in a 4-3. Gets rid of it. Can't it. Number 56 comes up to make the play at the 32-yard line. It's first and 10. The corners move up to play this one time. The Vikings line up in a 4-3. Hand it off to the back. Hardy is there for the tackle at the 35. This is one of those games where you just keep running it at him. Four yards here. Five yards there, loosen them up, and then win. You Zay, knock Zay, them out late in the game with that long Zay. touchdown run. And off to the tailback, play action. Rowing, number 56, is there on the stop at the 41-yard line. Jensen with a decent six-yard game. Third and under a yard. All on the 41-yard line. What's green? The Vikings come out with eight guys in the box, giving some cushion on the outside. Gets the call. Number 90 is there for the tackle. At the 48, everything they do works on third down. Yeah, no matter what down it is, when you keep moving the chains and you keep the defense out in the field, you're having a productive drive. Hey, let's go one deep. 
They line up in the I formation. Let's do our thing. Let's go. Be good. Here comes the blitz. Gets rid of it. Clean it pass to the back. Number 48 Number comes up to make the play. The At the Game 49, Breeze picks up about two yards with that completion. It'll be second down. Come on. Eighth play of this drive. All right around midfield. Yard line. The corners are giving a bit of a cushion. Let me go. Minnesota comes out in a 4-3. Jensen, the man in motion. All day, baby. Come on. Here we go. Cut. Crosses it right. Number 90 is there for the tackle at the 49-yard line. I'll tell you, if you want to run outside the tackles, you have to seal off the inside and kick out the outside to have some kind of hole to run through. That just didn't happen in that play. They'll play things tighter on the outside. Number 31, the lone setback. Dropping back. Closing in. Can't bring him down. Gets rid of it. Right to the back. Number 90 is there on the stop at the 38. So they're able to pick up another first down. This offense is clicking. They're making the right calls at the right time. And this is the 10th play of this drive. Fresh coverage on the outside. Minnesota comes out in their nickel package. Talking about Receives the handle. They'll spot this one at the 34. And that's now run. three tackles for him four. in this game. And this is the Second 11th play of this drive. Ball on the 34-yard line. Check it. All right, now. Hey, watch the the Vikings come out in a nickel package. Drops back. Gets the pass off. Pass ball's incomplete. Jensen the was the intended incomplete. receiver on that Jensen, play. The intended receiver on the play. 12th play of this drive. Ball on the 34-yard line. Here I go. Here I go. Set. Set him up. Three shoot. Deuce it, deuce it. Hey. With the throw, and the catch is made. Jones yes, is there for the this tackle at the 27-yard line. Jensen is able ten. to come down with it, Ball and that completion will keep the chains line. moving. I'll tell you, there's no substitute for picture-perfect route run. The Vikings come out in a nickel pack. A little misdirection. Is there on the stop at the nine. The They've got the defense off balance. It's another first down. You know, this defense has tried everything. Man coverage, a blitz, the zones, a six defensive backs, seven defensive backs. They really mix up their defenses and their coverage. And the offense has taken advantage of it. Rose, Rose comes up to make the play at the five. Good read on that play. He saw them drop back in zone and took advantage. That's the kind of efficiency that the coach is looking for out of him. Take what the defense gives, don't force it, protect the football, those kinds of things. The Vikings come out on the 46. Dropping back. Pressure. Plenty of time. The big man gets in there for a big sack. He's got a great combination of size and move. He won't be running any races. He's good at getting after the quarterback. But let me tell you, you never want him to be the guy falling on top of you. So they're inside the 20, need to get a touchdown. Number 31 moves in motion. They're coming with the blitz. Steps up into the pocket with the throw. The pass falls incomplete. King Watson causing the incompletion. I'll tell you, there are plenty of guys in the league who take pride in making hits like that, especially when it causes an incompletion. Number two, looking to make a good kick here. The veteran connecting for the field goal. Each play you run on offense tires out the defense a little more. When you can put together that many plays in a row, it gets you into scoring position. This time, it got him three. Philadelphia is lined up for the kickoff. Number 86, back to return. From the two. The flags are down, and this one appears to be on the offense. The team has to show discipline and execute properly out there. If they don't, they'll find it's much harder to overcome the other team and get a win. The Eagles come out of the 46 with the throw right on target to the wide receiver. 
Number 32 is there on the stop the at the 49. He's very dangerous, John, after he has the ball. He's one of those guys in the NFL who can really fly. He does a good job running his routes, and you can count on him to make the catch if you can get to it. But what makes him really special is what he does once he gets it in his hands. You have a good balance of run and pass on offense. The defense doesn't have a chance to focus in on either one of them. They need to be prepared to cover both options. The defense is going to play this one very tight. The Eagles come out with eight guys in the box. Looking for room. Jackson comes up to make the play at the 41-yard line. The defensive tackle surged through the line to bring the runner down. After one quarter of play, the score is set, and we're ready to start the second quarter. A smart coach would call this play. Third down, and to convert, they have to get it to the 39 on this play. The Eagles come out with eight guys in the box. Hand it off. Number 32 comes up to make the play at the 34. And he was able to create a lot of space on that run, John. Well, it started with some good blocking. And when he got through there, he turned up field, and they weren't in position to tackle him. Off-balance throw. This one falls incomplete. That's what I like to see. A defensive player putting a good look on a guy to force the drop pass. Taylor had the coverage on the play. Second and 10. Ball on the 34-yard line. Open, 46 Seven, defense in this time. The With a counter play. Ball loose. The Eagles scoop it up. Lose the ball in the back. So with the play in question, the coach has decided to challenge the call. Yeah, they might get this call reversed. The coach is hoping to get it right here because that could be a big lift to the team. What the official will be looking for here is to see if the knee is down. It's tough to say with that replay. This one won't be easy. The player was down. And that challenge the was a court. good decision as the call is overturned. Well, sometimes the official sees what you see, and sometimes he sees something else. But this time, everyone could see the call had to be changed. Third down, and they'll have to try to get it to the 24-yard line to pick up a first down. The corners are moving up to press the receivers. The defense changing its coverage. Gets the pass off. It's caught. Five. Touchdown, Touchdown Vikings. Minnesota. Romo finds the weakness in the defense and makes them pay. Number five. Comes in for the extra point. The point after is good. They got excellent field position and made the most of it. They took the ball by the horn. They weren't the about to let that favorable Points circumstance turn out unfavorably. Should be a return here. This one is handled by number one. The offense ready to go again after their last drive ended with three points. First and ten. Press coverage on the outside. First and ten. Out of the eye formation. Hey. Pressure coming. Gets the pass off. Gets his hand on it. Number 31. Was his intended target. Brian was there on the coverage. Second and 10. Ball on the 25 yard line. It's showtime, baby. Watch the first. Here I go. Set. We're talking about me. Dropping back. Under pressure. Gets rid of it. Incomplete pass. Good push by the defensive line, forcing the incomplete pass. He hung in there. But he didn't really have the time that he needed to make the play. The quarterback has to know who his outlet guy is and get the ball to him when he feels that pressure coming. And here's a look at each team's success on third down so far. Seven defensive backs in on this one. Steps up, throwing. 
The wide receiver has it. McGill comes up to make the play. At the 41, the defense blitzes the corner, but the quarterback got rid of it quickly for a completion and the first down. That was a great play because he saw him coming, remained calm, and threw an accurate pass. The Vikings come out with one linebacker and several defensive backs. Looking to run it here. Maxwell is there for the tackle at the 42. They might not be busting off big games, but those linemen are really working hard down there. One yard gain on that play. Number 31, the lone back. They'll bring the blitz. Stepping up, throwing. Swings it out to the right. McGill is there on the stop at the 45-yard line. You saw the whole field was able to stand back there and find the open man. You know, when the defense is sending extra rushers at the quarterback, it takes a lot of poise to get the ball out of there with any accuracy. Ball on the 45-yard line. The Vikings come out in a dime package. Coming through, baby. Off to the back. They're going to spot this one at the 42-yard line. He records his third tackle of the game. The defense is trying to shut down the running game early to force him to pass. We'll have to see if it works and causes him to give up on it here in the first half. Minnesota comes out in their nickel package. Gives the ball off. Clark comes up to make the play at the 41. The defense no looking the for play. the run, and the runner just about got back to the line of scrimmage. There was no possibility of going up the middle and picking up anything. The corners are moving up to press the receivers. The offense has been stepping it up on third down all day. They're coming with the blitz. Steps up into the pocket. Picked off. It's intercepted. They sent the corner on a blitz, and it created a turnover. There are good times to send your corner, and there are bad times to send your corner. That was a good time. So they're ready to go on offense after the interception. They'll start at the 31. Langford, the lone back, going to the air on first down. Alford is there on the stop at the 41. Bryant didn't have much room to do anything with that one. Yeah, they had the coverage, and they made the sure play instead of trying something fancy, like going for the pick. Second and inches. Ball on the 41 yard line. Let's go. Hey, watch that street. Here I go. The Set Eagles three. come out with eight guys three. in the box. Let's go. Keep the Dropping down. back. Gets rid of it. The defense has it. The veteran safety is there for the interception. You know, there are three types of safety ones who play the run well, ones who play the pass well, and ones that do both well. He's a both kind of player. <laughs> Philadelphia calls a timeout. They have two timeouts remaining. First and ten. Ball on the 35-yard line. Stay at home. Defense, get ready. We are close. Only safety. one man in the backfield. Hey. With a counter play. Gaines is there on the stop at the 46. A nice run on that play. His quick feet allow him to move out of the way just before the tackler can wrap him up. First and 10. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. The Vikings come out in a nickel package. Going to the air on first down. Throws on the run. The wide receiver has it. Maxwell is there for the tackle at the 41. John, he's proven he's a consistent target. Yeah, especially in situations where they're looking to get first down yardage. The Vikings come out in a nickel package. With the throw, incomplete as the defender knocks it away. He has a knack for making a big play. That was another one right there. Number eight was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Nickelback in this time. A little misdirection. 
Number 48 is there for the tackle at the 36-yard line. Number 31 hits the handoff on the misdirection play and picks up six yards. Two-minute warning five. coming up. Ball on the 36-yard line. Let's turn it up, D. We turn it up. They've done very well on third down to this point. Two third minutes left. Five. Ball on the 36-yard line. Go make the play. Keep the throttle down. Nice job so far on third Keep down for the offense, and we'll okay, see if that continues that. here. Closing in. They reached him just as he was throwing. Brady pressure can really change the way an offense operates. They need to keep some extra blockers in, either a tight end on the line or a back that can help them out with their protection. Number two needs to hit this one perfectly to have a chance. The kick is long enough and good. And give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three even if you don't get it in the end zone every time. This one is taken by number 86. Now you have to decide if they just want to run the clock out or they want to drive it down in field goal range. Looks like they'll play bump and run on the outside. Langford, the lone setback. Throws on the move. This pass is incomplete. Well, he saw the receiver hauling it in, and then boom, he pops him, and it ends up incomplete. Davis with the coverage. Ball on the 35-yard line. Bump it up, bump it up. Play two quarters, two quarters. The Eagles come out on the 46. Hey, watch the screen. 74. Knock him out. Pressure gets the pass off. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. The defense forced the issue that time, John. And the guys up front got good pressure, forcing him to get rid of that one before he wanted to. Langford, the lone back. With the pass. The pass falls incomplete. Falls incomplete. Prior, the intended receiver on the play. Martin comes into the game for the punt. Williams lines up deep for the punt return. He kicks a line drive. No return here. Back it comes to the 20. It's first and 10. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. The Vikings come out in a nickel package. Hand it off to the back. Is there for the first tackle down, at the 40. That'll be a first down as he bowled his way forward through a couple of would-be tacklers. He was running with extreme focus and determination because he knew how far he had to get. He wasn't about to take a loss on the play. Minnesota comes out in their nickel tackle. They give it to the halfback. Play action. Throwing on the run. And it's complete. Maxwell is the guy who's there to bring him down at the 46-yard line. It's second down and four to go. The corners move up to play this one tight. Number 31 in the backfield. Hands it off to the back. Number 48 is there on the stop at the 48. Number 31 has gained enough for another first down, his second of the drive. First and ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. All right, now. Everything you've got. Minnesota comes out with seven in the secondary. Pressure coming. Throws an incomplete pass. He appears to feel the pressure there. So many passing attacks in the NFL rely on timing. When you can put pressure on the passer, you never give him a chance to get into a rhythm. And you force him to throw the ball before he wants to. The Vikings come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. Here comes the blitz. Gets rid of it. Jumps up. He has it. Rhodes comes up to make the play. At the 27. Drew Brees is one of those guys who plays with a little chip on his shoulder. Press coverage on the outside. Minnesota comes out in the quarter defense. Looking to run it here. Look at that power. 
Ames is there for the tackle at the eight-yard line. We need to watch the guys up front on this play. They're going to be passing. And the best thing the defense can do here is to get some pressure on the quarterback. Either throw a pick or take him down for the sack. They kicked the field goal the last time they were in the red zone. Firing a ball into the end zone. Touchdown, Eagles. Drew Brees delivers it for six points. They line up to go for two. It's all nothing. They don't get no set. Regular, regular. Blue Dan, Blue Dan. Wake it up, baby. Danny, Danny, Looking Danny, for the corner. Danny, Danny. They've got it. Diversion. And they're all tied up. Number two is back and ready to put this one in the air. Back deep to return. This one is fielded by number 86. The defense shut down the offense the last time they had the ball. It's first and ten. Ball on the 18-yard line. Romo from the shotgun. Dropping back to pass on first down. Rose it. And he fails to hang on to that one. And this should be the last play of the half. On the 18 yard line. Tackles, tackles. Set. Red, 58. All right, let's go. Dropping back. Rolls right. Under pressure. On the move. Pass falls incomplete. They'll go to the locker room with the score. We're ready to begin. Mark looks like he's just one. about ready to and kick this one off. Lined up for the kickoff. Boyce back to return. From the four. <laughs> Number one Mark returns, returns this one to the is now on the sideline and he could be done for the day. Breeze will have a chance to show how he can run this offense. Using split backs. Closing in. Gets rid of it. Swings it out to his running back. Rowe is there for the tackle at the 35-yard line. Number 31 is the go-to guy. Tighten up, tighten up. Be careful. Stay Defense, get ready. Come on. There's a flat guy. Set. Tucks it away. Rhodes comes up to make the play. And that game will get them a fresh set of downs. It was a great run. He saw his blockers create some room for him, and he accelerated right through the hole. Press coverage on the outside. Minnesota using three linebackers. Going to the air on first down. Gets the pass off, and he hits his target. A successful offense is one that can run and throw for good yardage on first down. Pick up of about eight. Ball at about midfield. The defense is going to play this one very tight. The Vikings line up in a 4-3. They'll spot this one at the 42-yard line. The and so that makes tackle number six. He broke a tackle in the backfield and got the first down. Yeah, great play by the defender getting in the backfield. But he didn't wrap him up. They'll go from the I formation. Pass play here on first down. Steps up. Gets rid of it. This pass is incomplete. Jensen was the intended receiver on that play. Receiver on the play. Second and ten. The corners Ball are moving up to press the receivers. I'm coming through, baby. Out of the eye formation. Let's turn it up. He hands it off. Great fake on the run. Number 55 is there on the stop at the 37. Number seven completes the pass for a five-yard gain on second down. Third down play upcoming to convert. They have to get it to the 32. Press coverage on the outside. 
The defense has had difficulty stopping them on third down. They're coming with the blitz. Gets rid of it. The wide receiver has it. Number 56. Takes him down before he can get the first. Jensen couldn't find a way to get past the marker. Number two will try to put them ahead with this field goal. A good start to the second half, engineering a drive that ends with a field goal. That's a real good way to get momentum going in your favor. Back to return. And he got all of that one, a great kick. From the three-yard line. Minnesota is trying to take the lead on this drive as they take over. Ball on their own 27. Romo did not get into a rhythm in the first half, and let's turn to his passing chart now to discern where he struggled. With the pass, complete to the wide receiver, Alford comes up to make the play at the 39-yard line. Johnny has such a quick release, and the ball is out before anybody knows what's happening. And that makes it hard for him to be sacked, and it gives the defenders less time to react. So after that nice catch and run, here's a look at his stats. Eight defenders in the box on this one. And off to the tailback. Taylor is there on the stop. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. They're looking for the run with all those linebackers out there. Yeah, you see them. Let's go, D. Let's go. Watch out. Come on. Everything you've got. Let's go. Hey. On the carry. Stiff arm keeps him good. Number 53 comes up to make the play. At the 48, gain of a handful. Three minutes remaining in the quarter. Philadelphia now crams the line of scrimmage with defenders. The Eagles come out of the 46. Pressure with the throw. He hits his receiver. A solid tackle in the open field by number 32. They convert for the first down on that throw. And they ran the perfect play to get those couple of yards. Ball on the 26-yard line. Let's go, D. Tighten up. Set. Back in the gun. All right, here we go. Play hard and fast, baby. Gets the pass off. They'll spot this one at the nine-yard line. He stops him there, and according to our numbers, that's tackle number six for him. This offense having no trouble moving the ball on this drive. Yeah, and this defense is having a lot of trouble stopping it. They can't seem to key on what they're doing and put an end to this drive. The defense changing its coverage. They've had some big scoring plays, but this is their first time in the red zone. Throws this one off balance. Almost intercepted. I can't complete that short pass, and it's second down. The intended receiver on the play. It's second and goal at the nine. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. Gets the pass off. Incomplete pass. Green was his intended target. Green, the intended receiver on the play. It's third, third and goal, and goal at the nine-yard line. Hey, let's go one deep. Here we go, baby. The Second Eagles deep, come out with deep. eight guys in the box. Let's make a play. Hey. Throws it. Touchdown, Vikings. Touchdown, Vikings. Romo puts points on the board with that pass. Second. Number five. Comes in to attempt the point after. The, the point after point is, good, is good, and they move ahead after a well-orchestrated drive. They were clicking on all cylinders that time, and they Points. found the right Back spot in the defense to attack. Sends it sailing. This one is handled by number one. Big opening. He dives, touchdown. touchdown. You talk about those things that you'd take with you if you were building a team. I'll take this whole special teams unit. Number two comes in for the extra point. 
The extra point attempt is good. good. Special teams plays are sometimes overlooked, but not there. A kick Philadelphia return for a touchdown. A yeah, special teams Number play 86. can swing right. momentum in a heartbeat. A kickoff return, a block field goal, all that stuff can sure change the entire tone of a game with just one play. From the eight-yard line. The defense looks to rebound after that last effort when they allowed a touchdown. First and ten. will start the drive at the 33-yard line. First and ten. Langford, the lone back. Tucks it away. They'll go with a play fake. Long throw. Incomplete pass. He just flicked his wrist and the ball just took off. He just needed to take a little bit off of that one. And it could have gone for a big play. Price was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Second and ten. Ball on the 33 yard. They'll play things tighter on the outside. The Eagles come out on the 46. Pressure coming. Gets rid of it. Incomplete. He somehow got that pass off. The play didn't work because the quarterback's timing and balance was off. When he starts to feel pressure, he gets a little nervous and he has to get rid of the ball. Drops back with the pass. Incomplete pass. That's a way to make a throw with nothing but air. They had the coverage on the play. Martin will come in now to punt it away. Williams is back to receive this kick. A line drive. From the 15-yard line. Williams takes the punt to the 23. First and 10. They'll play things tighter on the outside. First and 10. Using Man, split backs. Go, hey. Throws it. Broken up. The so, second down upcoming. Number 50 on the coverage. Hey. Second and 10. Looks Ball like they'll play the bump and run on the outside. Line. It's showtime, baby. Get it on. Set. Steps up. He has time. Rowing. Number 90 comes up to make the play. At the 34, he put something extra on that throw, and that'll keep the chains moving. And that's what it takes sometimes, because defenders are so quick that one millisecond can make a difference. With the counter play. McGill. He's there on the stop at the 42-yard line. It seems like he's picking up huge chunks of yardage every time they hand him the ball. Minnesota lines up in the 46. Gets the call. Number 50 comes up to make the play at the 45. Number 31 is having an outstanding day with over 100 yards rushing. Ball on their own 45. Ball on the 45-yard line. Bring it up, bring it up. The Vikings come out in a 4-3. On the ground. Fakes the handle. Throws on the run. Behind him, he has it. The 40, the 30. Strong move. The 10. Touchdown, Eagles. He kept his legs moving, protected the ball, and made it to where he wanted to go. Number two comes in to attempt the point after. The point after is good. Now they've put it together offensively with 14 unanswered points. They have a lot of talent on the offensive side of the ball. Scoring runs like this aren't all that unusual for them. Nice distance. This one is fielded by number 86. Keeps his feet moving. They forced a three and out on the last series. It's first and ten. They'll play things tighter on the outside. 
The Eagles come out on a 46. On the counter play. Lynch is there for the tackle at the 42-yard line. He completed three quarters of play, and the score is 31-21. Eagles. The teams are set for the fourth quarter of play. Second and nine coming up here. Romo with split back. And off to the tailback. Number 53 comes up to make the play. At the 48, Langford runs it through the middle again of about six. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. Press coverage on the outside. They're looking for the run with all those linebackers out there. Hand it off to the back. Jackson tackles him, but not before the first down is reached. He gets just barely enough for the first down. First and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. What's the hard count? Only Set. one man back. They solved, man. Yellow. What is that? One of us will make a play. Check it. Right here. Here it comes. Here we yeah. go. 74. What was the time? With the carry. Great fake. Steps up. He's going for it all. He's there for the catch. He does a good job finding the receiver. That pass will help cut into the lead. Number five comes in for the extra point. The point after is good. The Vikings find themselves right back in this one. Now it's up to the defense to hold them. Martin in to kick this one off. Boys, back to return. From the one yard line. Philadelphia takes over on offense, looking to extend their lead. The Eagles will start the drive at the 34 yard line. First and 10. To the tailback. Hardy is there on the stop. At the 32, on the number 31, one was dragged down before he could get to the line of scrimmage. Second and long. Looks like they'll play bump and run on the outside. Let's go now. Let's go. Let's go. Minnesota comes out in their nickel package. Drops back. Stepping up, gets the pass off. It's batted away. That's just great positioning by the defender. He has his eyes in the backfield the whole time, and he was right there to break the play up. Jensen was the intended receiver on that play. The Vikings come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. It's a blitz. Gets rid of it. Right on target to the wide receiver. And so a risky call to send the corner back fires and they give up a first down. Some quarterbacks love blitzing corners because they know that there's one less cover man out there and they have a lot better shot at hitting someone in stride. The Vikings come out in a nickel package. He'll pass on first down. Under pressure. Throws on the move. Incomplete. John, he rushed that throw. And you should credit the defensive line. They do a nice job tying up the blockers and can bring pressure up the middle. When you combine their play with the fact that the defensive coordinator likes to bring additional blitzers from the outside, it can make for a very long day for the quarterback. Using split backs. Stepping up, throwing. Maxwell is there for the tackle. That's the 41-yard line. Well, John, the defense not expecting the fullback to make that catch. Well, they had the other receivers pretty well covered, but they never accounted for him. It's a pretty good game. Ball on the 41-yard line. Looks like they'll play bump and run on the outside. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. It's showtime, baby. The Vikings line up in a 4-3. Not today. Hey, let's go. It's a blitz. Gets rid of it. Incomplete pass. He barely got that one off. Yeah, it wasn't a sack. What it did was make the quarterback adjust his throw, and it messed up his rhythm. Second and ten. The defense is going to play this one very tight. Tighten up, tighten up. Watch out. Keep moving. Set. I'm coming through, baby. Here we go. 
Hands it off to the back. This one will be spotted at the 42-yard line. He makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. Number 31. Couldn't pick up any blocking on that play. Third down here. They have to get it to the 31-yard line to convert. Looks like they'll play bump and run on the outside. These third downs haven't been much of an obstacle, and it's helped them to take the lead. They'll bring the blitz. Takes off. Jenkins comes up to make the play at the 33-yard line. So it's fourth down after a fine defensive play that prevents him from getting past the marker. Number two will have to get a lot of leg into this one. He got all of it. Number two extends their fourth quarter lead with that long one. Philadelphia is lined up for the kickoff. Number 86 back to return. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. This one is taken by number 86. This is one of those spots where they have to put something together because they're just running out of time. Ball on their own 18. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. The Eagles come out in the 46. Keep the throttle down. Hand it off. Keeps his feet. Robinson is there for the tackle at the 26-yard line. The guys up front have been doing a heck of a job opening holes for the running game today. Ball on their own 26. Press coverage on the outside. The Eagles come out with eight guys in the box. Screen comes in motion. The ground. Alford is there on the stop at the 32-yard line. So he gets about five yards and the first. Nothing fancy either. He just goes right at the defense to move those chains. Romo with split backs. Hand off to the tailback. They'll go with a play fake. Looking for the long completion over the middle. You just can't find a way to bring that one in. The quarterback did a great job of getting some air under that pass. Hitting his guy right in the hand. It just looked like he might have lost a little focus as he tried to bring that pass in. Jennings, the lone back. With a counterplay. Lynch comes up to make the play. At the 35-yard line. Third and seven coming up here. The corners are moving up to press the receivers. Hand it off. They'll spot this one at the 43-yard line. He found the ball carrier to make his fourth stop of the game. Great run there. That'll be a first down. He really ran well there. He gets some great blocks, and he has patience as he picks up the first down. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. The Eagles come out with eight guys in the box. Pass play here on first down. It's batted away. He has a great feel for defending the pass. And he always seems to be in great position to make a play in the ball. Price was his intended target. The corners are moving up to press the receivers. The Eagles come out of the 46. Looking to run it here. Great fake. Looking left for the long pass. What a catch. The 20. Gilmore is there for the tackle. At the 15. The play is a first down. We've reached the two-minute mark, tightening up the coverage along the outside. The Vikings come out in the bunch for me. On the ground. And we're all tied up. And that run ties the game here in the fourth. Number five will break this fourth quarter tie if he can kick the extra point here. The extra point attempt is good. Now that's how you put things together on offense late in the game. And they really got it done on that drive. Calling excellent plays and executing them. Moving down the field for the score. John, if he can return another one, his team will take the lead here in the fourth. I'll tell you, every team in the league wants a game breaker like him in their roster. Squib kick short from the 25-yard line. Running with purpose. You know, they only need a field goal, so the defense needs to make sure they don't fall asleep here. The 
ball on their own 40. The defense is going to play this one very tight. The defense lines up in the nickel. Hands it off to the back. Jenkins is there for the tackle at the 42. Number 31. Takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Second and nine. Ball on the 42-yard line. Damn, damn. We turn it up. Minnesota comes out in a 46. Gets rid of it. Rose is there on the stop at the 50-yard line. Number 80 makes the catch but doesn't get very far. And that's what the mark of a solid defense is. They close in on you in a hurry, and they don't miss tackle. The corners move up to play this one time. Hey, let's go. Stop. No, stop that motor. He'll sneak it. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. So the quarterback runs with it and ends up going nowhere. The Eagles call a timeout. They have two remaining. Fourth and three. Closing in. On the move. It's broken up. They go for it and don't make it. That was a conversion the offense needed. They have to be disappointed, and it's worse because now the other team has the ball. The Vikings will start the drive. The defense is going to play this one very tight. First and ten. They line up in the eye formation. Hands it off to the back. The 30. Taylor is there for the tackle at the 24. 23 yard gain on the play. Ball on the 24 yard line. Ball on the 24 yard line. The Eagles come out in the 46. Ball in this direction. They'll spot this one at the 15 yard line. So that tackle was his third. I'll tell you, he might have one of the fastest first steps in football. He's one of those guys who is patient, accelerates quickly, and is very good at using his downfield blockers. A little over a minute left. Ball on the 15-yard line. Hey, let's go one deep. It's on. Langford, the deep man. Langford is there on the stop. Huge first down. Gain of two on the play. 12 yards needed to get into the end zone. Time, baby. With a counterplay. Good read by the defense there as they knew the quarterback was going to run with it and they shut him down. It's second down and 15 to go. The corners are moving up to press the receivers. Rolling right. Throws to the end zone. Makes the catch. Touchdown, Vikings. They put up six points by beating the coverage. Well, the cover two works well because it eliminates options. At that time, the quarterback made a quick read, and he got it off quickly. Number five. Comes in to attempt the point after. Minnesota calls a timeout. They have one left. So a most interesting call here as they'll set up for a two-point conversion and a chance to make the other team have to score twice. Can he get there? They don't get the two points. Comes in to kick off.
Yellow, 74. Blue, 74. Green, 16. Green, 25. Blue, 58. Seven. Yellow, 16. Green, 16. Blue, 25. Yellow, red, 58. Blue, 74. Yellow, 74. Red, yellow, set. 16. Hut. 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 Yellow, yellow, 58. Blue, 16. Yellow, green, 74. Set. Blue, green, 25. Red, green, 58. Set. <laughs> 